This is the continuation of uh, applications of calculus in commerce and economics, a part of uh, grade 12 mathematics, commercial arithmetic, ISC syllabus. Coming to certain terms, average revenue is total revenue by X, marginal revenue is derivative of the total revenue, and marginal average revenue would be derivative of the average revenue. Coming to a few questions, the demand function is given by P equal to 1500 minus 2x minus x squared. Find the marginal revenue for any level of output x. Also find the marginal revenue when x equal to 10. R equal to Px, so R would be 1500x minus 2x squared minus x cubed. Marginal revenue would be derivative of the total revenue that would be derivative of this which is 1500 minus 4x minus 3x squared. And marginal revenue when x equal to 10 is substitute x equal to 10 here you get 1160. Question 2. The total revenue in rupees received from the sale of x units of a product is given by Rx equal to 300x minus x squared by 5. Find the average revenue, the marginal revenue and the total revenue when marginal revenue is 0. Rx is 300x minus x squared by 5. Average revenue would be total revenue by x that is 300 minus x by 5. And marginal revenue would be derivative of the total revenue that is 300 minus 2x by 5. When the marginal revenue is 0, you get 300 equal to 2x by 5. Solving, you get x equal to 750. So total revenue, when the marginal revenue is 0, is substitute the total revenue when x equal to 750. So you get it as 11,250. The next question, question 3. The marginal revenue function of a commodity is governed by marginal revenue equal to 9 minus 2x plus 4x squared. Find the demand function. Now revenue would be integral of the marginal revenue since marginal revenue is derivative of the total revenue. So integrating the marginal revenue you get the revenue function as 9x minus x squared plus 4 by 3x cubed. Now when x equal to 0 then uh, R would be 0. So C would also be 0. So R equal to 9x minus x squared plus 4 by 3x cubed. Now R equal to Px. So demand function P equal to R by x that is 9 minus x plus 4 by 3x squared. Question 4. A manufacturer's marginal cost function is given by marginal cost equal to 0.003x squared minus 0.6x plus 40, where x is the number of units of a product. If x increases from 100 to 200 units, find the total increase in cost. Total cost would be integral of the marginal cost, that would be 0.003x cubed by 3, which is 0.001x cubed, minus 0.6x squared by 2 which is 0.3x squared plus integral of 40 which is 40x. We need to find the total cost from 100 to 200 units. So total cost at x equal to 200 minus total cost at x equal to 100. Substituting here we get the difference as 2000.